Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. <clears throat> Ooh, and we got a fun fight to talk about. Francisco Trinaldo versus Danny Roberts. I got my thing to freaking scroll down for a second. Also, some munching on some bacon. But, yeah. Francisco Trinaldo, 43 years old. He will be 44 years old this year. 27 wins, 8 losses, 4 in 1 in his last 5 fights. Basically a pick em fight. Uh, Francisco Trinado is 5'9", 70 inch reach. The one loss to Francisco Trinaldo was Muslim Salikov. Salikov, I think that's how you say it. Who's a monster as it is too. Danny Roberts, 18 wins, 5 losses. He's 3-2 and two in his last five fights. Ran into a little bit of a rough patch, but he's really turned it around. Hasn't fought as much as I'm sure he's wanted to. Uh, two, he fought. He got a big knockout win against Nelam Amidov. I think that's how you say his name. Spun him around, if I am correct. And then he beat uh, Ramazan Amiv. Amiv split decision six months ago. He's 34 years old, 6'1", with a 74-inch reach. Something that we have seen something very, very well from Danny Hot Chocolate Roberts is when he's on, he tends to have really, really good movements. His combos are really fluid. He doesn't really, um, you know, mix it in. He's kind of like that. He can, but he tends to strike quite a bit. Um, <clears throat> again, four inch reach advantage for Danny Roberts. It, it's really, really hard because Francisco Trinaldo has some big, big power, but he tends to sometimes look for that a little bit too much instead of putting stuff together. Like Jai Herbert, he was down in that fight, and when he, he came back and he won, you know, Dwight Grant, he, he came back and he, you know, yeah, but he. And then on the flip side, Danny Roberts sometimes has a questionable chin because if Francisco Trinaldo drops that big bomb on the right hand on Danny Roberts, he may be able to put him out as well. But if he gets stuck in a position where he's down two rounds, can he really land that and win? I think so. I think Francisco Trinaldo, I think Francisco Trinaldo wins by knockout. Hopefully he doesn't scare me to death when I'm watching this fight because, again, he can be down and come back and win it. So, but yeah, Francisco Chernobyl, uh probably by finish if he's going to win it. But make sure you guys hit that thumbs up button as hard as you possibly can. Hit that subscribe button. helps me out so, so much. And you guys know what it is. <laughs>